What is she doing here? What? What are you talking about? You, Big Mama never shows up at these damn things. What? Yeah, these, these aren't mandatory. <sighs> okay. I know you told me that I was famous or whatever. But why am I really here? Well, um, some, um, some, you know, Joavin, um, from some distinguished clans wanted to meet you, and they had friends, you know, that didn't look too bad from my standards. Uh, am I, am I meant to be your wingman or something? You could say so. Are you legit me saying? <sighs> okay. Uh, I'm gonna end up killing you. What? No, 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 no. I, I, I am serious. You, you don't do that. I'm sorry. Okay. I, I, I am legitimate sorry. You know, I ain't gonna live forever. I can live a hell of a lot longer than you humans. But, you know what? Sometimes the genes need to be spread. No, you just want to get laid. That's also true. But still, come on, man. Just do this for me. And what do I do about Big Mama? All I can say is, good luck. Because as far as I'm concerned, no one has ever mounted that. So will be God. I mean it. If it turns out, what's under them right? <laughs> what's under them drawers? Oh, if this actually ends up happening. If there is nothing I recognize, or just, or if one of those damn, damn things have teeth, if there is teeth under that, I am going to find and kill you myself in such a horrible way that you would wish that you stayed in, on that damn barren planet in your exile. I can with the utmost honesty say no, they don't. If at the very least that's one of the things besides the boobers, I get that that we share with your species. Are you sure? Yes. How do you know? This isn't the first, my first radio. Okay. <clears throat> okay, good. <sighs> I still don't want to do this, man. But come on, man. Just, don't, just, just mingle a little bit. You can let people know about Nana and, you know, I think they won't give a damn. What? Well, when you really think about it, you guys are polygamous. I don't even know how. Na oh my God! What if Nana finds out about this? Just keep your mouth shut. Ugh. Oh, what if one of them tries to kiss me? Oh, oh dear God! What? Well, if one tries to give me... No. Oh, man, I don't even want to think about that. Without those teeth. <laughs> I told you, I'm telling you, there are no teeth down there. I'm not talking about... <sighs> Whatever. Let's just go. Let's... Fine, let's, let's, let's try this whole mingly thing. 
And yeah, Izuku and Scarface are pretty much walking around, just looking. It is time for the actual choosing, and he's like, okay, so is this done? No, no. We had to, we had to disrobe. Why? Well, usually, uh, someone would ch choose a maid due to their accomplishments as well as how long their dreadlocks are. But mine are actual hair. I can cut these off right now. Yeah, you, sh you shouldn't have picked. She really shouldn't have decided to look more like us in that regard. <laughs> I, you want to die this day. It would not be ideal, but if anything, fine. Is Izuku drops all his armor. He puts his weapons away. So what? What now? Just, just standing in in line. The women will come or go, depending on their preferences. Uh, hopefully, they're not in the mood for a human. Well, I did say you have fans, so it's there's always a possibility. And this is. And this maze is more than just trying to get someone knocked up, right? Well, that's... It's usually just to pass on the best genetics. And with your uh, influx of hybridization, we see how you barely change at all. Huh. Yeah. That's a pretty useful trait. What? Yeah. Seriously. Do you know how much hybridization of Gyalja can go under? But it could greatly change their genetic structure. When it comes to you, yours doesn't change much at all. You just integrate it into your DNA as if it was there to begin with. Huh. So if anything, you are a catch you, you if anything uh you are a trophy fish no yes i'm i'm very serious you are very lucky i or i have not not i don't even know how she would like this hmm very good point very good one <sighs> but seriously hopefully you you don't become that guy. What do you mean? Well, the way we can choose whoever they want, despite having a husband already, they could leave the husband or just get another one, depending on, you know. So you're saying you, what you're saying is I could actually steal someone's wife legally. Yes, I mean, the husband would probably hate you forever, probably try to kill you and whatnot, but, you know. And, so, what you're really saying is, yeah, you could be Mr. Steal Your Girl, yes. <clears throat> Cripes. This sucks. Actually, it's quite pleasant. Fuck. Shut up. I can't believe you just did this to me just because you want some nookie. Seriously, man, that's 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 some that's simple logic, man. You you you, you can you don't do this to me. I'm sorry. Do you know what it's like to be exiled from your clan, which was known to be prestigious as hell? We were an elite clan. Yeah, until you screwed up. You took off your bio mask. That was your fault. It doesn't mean I gotta suffer. You won't suffer. So I can say no? 
Well, you technically can, but you see, if you do, she could challenge you. What? Yes. What kind of challenges are these? Well, just a fight or a hunt or, you know, when she, if she wins, she gets to spend as much time with you, you could say, as she wants. Okay, and so if I lose the potential battle, yeah. And uh, another question. If I were to lose, how well, how, how much stamina does a normal Yajo Wyman have? Um, I'm scared to tell you on the grounds you might run. Fuck this. <laughs> He's like, just grabbing his shit and just walking off. Like, no, you can't leave. Watch me. As in plasma casters just get trained on him. Like, you will participate. There, there is no leaving. Uh, I have to. Yes. Uh, Scarface. Hey, just, just be, just. Hopefully this leaves. You get to get to leave, because there's no guarantee you will get picked. Fine, him dropping his gear and just getting back in line, and then they release the women. Oh, it's. I'm sorry, Izuku. Not really, but I'm sorry. As yes, surprisingly, there are. More than Scarface really anticipated wanting Izuku. And then Big Mama shows up, just eyeing Izuku, looking down, towering over him. So, oh, I am not getting out of this at all, am I? Well, I guess I'm just going to have to challenge you guys. What? You should have rephrased that. What? You rejected them all at once. So they will challenge you all at once. Uh, no. Yes. You should. You should, have, you should have just rejected them one by one. It it would have been so. It would have been so much more. Merciful towards you. At the very least, the odds of your genetics being put to good use. The the odds of that are very high now. Can I kill him? I'm just asking anyone who's listening. They, they, can I kill him right now? Please, I I I will make his death. Quick. Well, that's a lie. But still, I... <sighs> okay. I take that as a... No. Just hearing nothing but silence. It is, it's pretty much a big arena. And Izuku sees that... Yeah, they're not wearing anything but rags. As it is he... He is too. Just okay. So, what kind of battle is this? Humans will call it wrestling. WWE wrestling. Oh God, no! I'm dead. Him just receiving blow among blow. Him being able to knock a few of them off their feet, but they just came came back up again. And then Bimawa just starts walking out to him, picks him up, and continuously slams him to the ground over and over and over again. 
so much, so with such force, him, he's thinking, oh my gosh, she's going to break my pelvis, isn't she? She's going to break me. In which, as soon as she just drops him, his bones are broken. <laughs> his legs, his arms, even some ribs. He's healing, but the amount of stamina needed to heal all of that, he can't even fight anymore. As they just say, submit. I do not concede defeat until I am unconscious. Very, very poor choice of words. And Ben Mama just smacks him upside the head instead of him flying into the arena wall. He blacks out. As soon as he wakes back up, he sees... Yeah, he sees Scarface with his whammy and he's... Oh, what happened? He lost. It, oh, I figured that. Seriously, that was so unfair. So what are you doing here? Um, uh, well, I'm here to rewatch watch over you until you woke up. Um, if anything, they're waiting for you. What? Yes, there's... They're waiting for you on uh, Big Mama's ship. This is this is gonna happen, isn't it? Yeah. So I I there's no way for me to get out of this. No. Like I said, you should have just rejected them one at a time, but you didn't. So that made it too easy for them to try gang up on you. I'm sorry. But everything worked out great for me. <sighs> Fine. Fuck it. Let's, let's, just, let's just get this over with. How long could this t really take? Oh, you poor, poor fool. As soon as Izuku heads into Baby Mama's ship, he sees them. Just, you say, ready to receive his genetics. They they are primed and ready. Sick of him just like, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, no. Oh, sweet Jesus. Why? Why must this happen to me? Because I say so. <laughs> We see how nervous he is, which actually does shock them, because they do know about Nana. But, here. What? What's this? It's Kitlet. What's that? Mm, it's it's kind of like what you humans would call booze. I'm underage. But no, what? Fuck it. As he just downs it. Another. <laughs> to a point where he is good and drunk. And. Very. More willing. Upon the. Waking of a. New morning. Izuku, he's. <clears> hmm. <throat> What the hell? Is that? Hmm. Hmm. Him just looking around. Oh. <sighs> oh god. What happened? Wait. What time is it? Yeah, oh, three thirty. Huh, I don't know what Scarface was talking about, saying it, that he was worried to tell me about their stamina. I mean, it's only been a day. Wait a minute, what day is it? As he sees, and it's been around a week and a half. Oh, holy shit. That, that 
Kitlib or whatever it's called. It's good, some good shit, isn't it? Him looking at all the other layouts, seeing that Big Mom is the only one who's actually awake. Yeah. Alright, the deed is done. You may leave whenever you're ready. Which, as soon as he does, he opens the door. And it's like. You? Me? Wait, what are you doing here? As, yes, it's the guy who's. Who, uh. Deku, he killed his son. You remember him, don't you? Okay. Maybe I was mistaken. I was. I was told my. Him? Peeking over Izuku's shoulder and seeing that. I. Uh, I'm. Ma Matilda? Huh? Who's Matilda? My wife. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. no. You mean I. I, uh. You. Just looking down at Izuku with rage in his eyes, it's like, it's bad enough. You killed my son. It's bad enough. You made me look weak in front of everyone. But now you do this. Is he, uh, as soon as she wakes up, she's like, oh, hi. It's like, oh. Oh. Oh, dear. Like, uh, I, I really didn't mean to. I had no idea you were married. But then again, considering you had a son, uh, it kind of would make sense. But still, I am very sorry. It's the, <clears throat> it was her choice. <clears throat> it was the law. That's how we do things, but that does not make it make feel any better. It is Izuku Pond just gathering up all his shit. He just walks off. It's like, again, I am so sorry. Just leave. As he just flies his ship back to Earth. I can never let Nana and the others know about what happened that week and a half.